you know, Robin, I got to talk to you, and I ask you this all the time. I mean, are you and Juan ever going to get married? I don't know, Andy. Guess what? I can finally <laughs> stop asking that question. It may have been a long road to get here, but after a little help from a friend, Juan finally put another ring on it. Let's see something happy. Yes, yes, please. Are you honestly going to marry Juan? For the last six years, we've gone around and around on this question. We gotta keep growing as a couple. We have to get married. The ball is now in his court. We're ready to come full circle and uh, get married again. <laughs> Jesus, won't he do it? How's the hat business going? I'm actually embezzled. <laughs> embezzled? <laughs> is it embezzled? <laughs> I, I launched my hat line embellished a couple months ago. My tax issues really makes me more laser focused. I want to invite all of the ladies to photo shoots. Oh. <laughs> You're a natural too. Say that. Her pictures are challenging for me. So is she getting cut out of the website? <clears throat> Where's Karen? So Karen's pictures did not turn out great. Juan is planning to propose to Rafa. Yeah, that. It's not possible. Why not? This is something I know. Juan has been reluctant to commit. What's happening? Maybe it won. Well, I want to do something real quick. What you gotta say now? Crocodile Dundee. All this shit that happens, I've stayed true to you the whole time. I know, you might go. Here's to a great bachelor party you in Vegas. Ah! Ah! Brother, you need to control your wife. She's out of control. You need to control. You should get the out of my face. Son. Yo, what? What are you, you touching me? You touching me? What? Hey, hey, you touching me? I'm not even entertaining this shit. You're gonna jail, you fool headed. Wow. Okay, well, first of all, round of applause for Juan Yay! and Robin. It's happening. Let's show the camera your ring. Oh, where's the camera? This way? Yeah. He put Did our ring it? on it. That's great. So, I mean, I have to assume you were very surprised. I was. I couldn't even breathe. Like, I had cotton mouth. My, my mouth really? was so dry. I was so shocked. COVID aside, what kind of wedding do you think you want to have, big or I, small? I would love to have a destination wedding, a small destination wedding. You guys were in the process of looking for houses. Any update on that? Yeah, so we actually are building a house. Have you started construction? We just got the permit, so they're going to break ground very soon, and then hopefully we'll be done by May. Are your embellished sales helping fund the house? They will definitely, yeah. I mean, they weren't necessary for it, but for sure. It, Is it doing well? Oh, my gosh. They're really they're so good cute. hats. Thank Why you. are they they're good? So I gave them they're one. They're lined. They're lined. Yes. They're they're lined. They're lined yes. Yes. with satin. Yes. They're lined with satin. And that is a big deal. Why? Because, because black girls and our hair. edges, we have to be protected. Yes. 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 It Got protects it. our hair. Yes. Wow. And so Fascinating. are you saying that <laughs> most hats <laughs> your hair up? Yes. 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 It dries yes. your hair out. But not yeah. the material. Yeah. But you didn't yeah. think that... Karen was a good spokesmodel for your hats. <laughs> to be honest, well, Karen's pictures, like I, everyone else's pictures were more like fun, having like a cute little pose. Karen, I felt, I honestly felt she didn't even want to be there. Like that was the energy that I got from her from the beginning of that photo shoot. May I? Yes, please. First of all, I wouldn't have taken time out of my day to come and support your business if I didn't want to be there. I'm not a fake and I'm not a phony. None of y'all are on their website now. Y'all know all your pictures have been they removed. They are, no. Where are they hidden deep? They're, they're on the product page. Oh, oh, also, she moved I them was, to the back. I so my question is, this for as a storyline or what? It would have spoiled everything. Okay. My sales have been tremendous. I'm happy The response for you. I've been overwhelmed with, and I'm really excited about the future of my business. So my picture's gonna be up when you go ahead and put everybody up? <laughs> <laughs> Do you want it up, Karen? Since, no. since they showed it, I could put no, it up. I'm well, kidding. you know what? Honestly, I, Karen, that hat... Um, once, I love that hat, by the way. I that did. hat was my, one of my slowest sellers, so I didn't <laughs> bring it back. <laughs>
<laughs> well, now, well, well she, now she, 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 I said I love the hat. <laughs> but <laughs> this just now, gets wait, wait worse and worse. You hate, you hate my hat. You threw it on the floor. Uh, right. Right. Yeah, I actually, I picked was, it up. I picked it up. No. But no, I really didn't you throw, throw it, throw it, it on, on the floor. floor. Thank you. Next. So, Robin, what's the status of your taxes? They have been handled. They have been handled. Yes. Go Z from Upper Marlboro, Maryland said, Robin, do you agree that it looks highly hypocritical to have called Karen out about her and Ray's tax issues, given that you ended up in the same situation? So I never criticized them for it. I just didn't understand how Karen did not know about it. But because now you do, because you didn't know about your own taxes not being paid, right? Exactly, that's what I'm saying. No, I'm saying, no, at that time, I knew that I had taxes that I needed to take care of. But you forgot to call of. your lawyer that day. But I did not, okay. I, I pushed the paper in a folder and didn't take care of it. So okay. I was not criticizing you, you, you all, for having the burden of taxes. Mm -hmm. I just did not believe that you, Karen, did not know about it. Giselle, Coco from Arkansas enjoyed seeing you and Juan hanging out and seeing him open up to you about how much he cared for Robin. Had you ever seen that side of him before? No, I, I freaking loved it. And I was just so happy that he was finally there and ready to put a ring on it. Ashley, I wish Michael was here to answer for himself, but what was up with all of the cryptic comments about Juan not marrying Robin? Michael tells me that he just didn't think that Juan would actually go through with wanting to get married because he was so comfortable with the way your situation was. Yeah, so, so. I actually, after I watched the episode, I called Juan, I was like, Juan, Michael is like going in on and saying like, oh, like he knows something, like what is up? He's like, Rob, I don't know what you're talking about. And Juan had no idea, so. Michael was, acted like he knew something. Yeah. Yes. He, he didn't tell me anything. And when I asked him about it later, that's what he said. If there is something, just say it, as opposed to being like, oh, this is not happening. Like, it was weird. And so I got really nervous, like, well, does he know something I don't know? Right. And, oh, my God, is this not happening? I got it weirded out. Chris Samuels, were you surprised Juan popped the question? To be honest, I, I'm happy for him. It is what it is. I mean, I, I'm so disgusted about people weaseling through stuff. I'm detaching myself from all of that mess. What? Um, no disrespect to that. I'm happy for you guys. You're disgusted by what? One day with my son, because you brought his name up, when he gets to be about 15 years old... Sir, I have no, no, nothing no, to no, do with... Pause one second, it's my turn. ...about your my, son. My turn. The question was when about When my child Juan. gets to be 15 years old... I'm so glad he's not he here right now. He has to I'm learn so glad about he's not women here. plotting, trying to say that I'm not his father, and it's very disturbing to me. I am so glad that Juan Dixon is not here right now.